Hello everyone and welcome back to Republic at War, the Let's Play. I'm sitting here and I'm looking at this fleet, right? And I'm... And I only see one Providence and no space station. Then I realize that we had that massive battle in the last episode. If you haven't seen those two battles, I highly recommend you check out that ep last episode. Because they were insane and they lasted basically the whole episode. And I think I lost most of my fleet or something here because I, I just don't seem to have anything at all. I'm rebuilding level 1 space station even. And we have a fleet over Corellia. We're building up space forces here as well. We're kind of in a bad position, to be honest, because if they attack me again here, I don't have the defenses to stave off another one of those massive Republic assaults. I hope that I killed off enough of their ships that I have a little bit of time because my production is not fast enough right now. I don't have enough producing and I don't have it producing fast enough. And it's not a matter of credits. It's more a matter of just how long it takes to produce things. So there's really not much that we can do except hope for the best, which I'm sure will happen, and keep building space stations and defensive forces, and then we have a little bit of a fleet here at Fresha. Very small fleet, so I'm thinking about sending a force made up of uh, all my tri-fighters and one Munificent, and that should be able to take that out. So we'll go there. We're already met with a tactical assault with... Um, Lots of Wookiees, lots of clones, lots of ATTs. So, do we have enough on the ground? I think we do. I think we have a full stack on the ground. We should be able to do this unless Wookiees start spawning in the back lines, which I, I'm sure they will, knowing this game, that Wookiees are just going to be everywhere. So, we'll see what happens. My main concern is that, that core. I could lose these three planets and not really be that, you know, sad about the losses of these three planets. I do keep that? pouring credits into that. We have 64 destroyer droids. But I do keep pouring credits into them. Has anyone seen uh, the new G -series? So we're going to send out our guys towards the landing zone. We have a lot of destroyer droids, so they're going to roll up really quick. Everything else is just going to take its time. I think something Don't weird is going on here. We've got clones incoming. What? Okay. We start the episode off, and we already have an amazing development. We have the technology of floating destroyer droids. Hovercraft destroyer droids. Ah, well. It's my programming. Uh, yeah. I have no idea what to do with those guys. We can finish I guess I need to like individually set up my attack orders now because these guys are bugged beyond all belief. They're stuck. They're just there. I, you know, at least we won't lose the battle because those guys will always just be there forever and ever. All right, destroyer droids, just eat them up. They all they have is infantry and mostly clones, so I'm happy with this development here. Just keep killing everybody. Look at all these clones and Wookiees just getting slaughtered right out of their transports. I love it. I love it. I just need some infantry down here to secure this landing zone. Or we just win. Oh, we did take the landing zone. Never mind. I For some reason, I thought that that was the clone army landing zone icon. But I guess not. So yeah, back back to the matter at hand after that interesting defense and interesting bug. We have another Providence built. So I'm thinking let's just keep doing it. Keep doing the Providence. We can build these carriers a little bit closer to the core. But we're going to move them up to Rendili because that's the fleet that needs it the most. And they're preparing another ground assault. Tactical battle imminent. Oh, there's that. There's that. Uh, battle 
that I sent out about Fresia. So we'll see what we can do here. We have a lot of Tri Fighters, and they have one Arc Squadron, so the goal is to take these Tries, kill the Arc Squadron, and use the Munificent on the Carrot Cruiser, and take it out. Oh, and we already found them. We sent our fighters too far. Arc Squadron is just getting taken out by the flat guns of the Munificent, so we didn't even need the Tries here. But we'll send them on them anyways. I just hope they don't meet the Carrot Cruiser somewhere. There we go. Okay, now we back them off. Tri Fighters did their job. Now we just gotta find a Carrot Cruiser. And kill them off. It's just a matter of finding this thing, because we have no idea where it is. And we don't want our fighters to get caught. Because that's unnecessary fighter death. So now comes the fun job of trying to find this frigate or corvette. It's just trying to save its own skin. There it is. There it is. Alright, try fighters Jump away. Munific munificent turn around and fire, please. There's all the guns right there. That's great. Alright, we're chasing it down. We've turned around. Now full throttle forward. Catch up to it. Keep the droids moving. There we go. Care Cruiser down. Awesome. So now that we have uh, a little bit of space supremacy, at least out here, it's very nice to see. Let's continue sending those ships up because we have a few. And we got to send them up. Come on. It takes so long to drag. That's great. And now we have some stuff building at Duro. Now I saw this. And I saw that Count Dooku gives us discounts, but he is not in the right planet. He should be at Duro. Are they really going to invade me again? Wow. Okay. I guess we're just stuck here with this massive assault. It's good that they're putting all their efforts into my Guido because I can dandily defend this. Our destroyer droids are still st stuck floating. That's so funny. And nothing moves. Don't fail me, General. In the new droid? Nothing moves out there. Great. I need servicing. So we gotta just manually assign everything to move. We had destroyed already. What did it hit? Okay. Take out the ATAPs, they're the biggest threat, and then just and then take out the Wookiees. You need to take out those Wookiees. So I think we already took the landing zone from what it looks like. Or we're taking it or something. Or no, they, they still have it. I can't tell because there's the icons are just all over. Look at this massive pile of bodies. Look at that. It's like... Goodness. Try walking over that. Try walking over that pile of bodies. You can't. If I were going down on a landing zone and I saw that on my... Of my troops just like slaughtered in just a big pile. I'd be like... Uh... How about no? Okay, so Count Dooku Duro. Easiest decision of my life because he's going to give us uh, nice discounts. There we go. There we go. These take a horrendous amount of time to build, I just realized. And I don't think they're... They're worth it. They're totally worth it. What am I talking about? They're totally worth it. We just need to split up a Lucre Hulk so that we have a Lucre Hulk at Rendili. We just got another space station, so up you go. Now we have one Lucre Hulk on each planet. And we're building space stations everywhere. We're waiting for the next paycheck to come in. And I'd like to move... I'd like to find a new home for uh, Newt Gunray here. I forgot his name, so I have to look it up. Can we build... Where can we build ships that we couldn't previously? Can Besting build ships? It might. I don't know if we can have a heavy factory. It doesn't look like we can have a... I want a place with a heavy factory and with a place that I can build... Whoa, I don't want that. A place where I can build heavy ships. And that has a pretty good shot into the core, so it doesn't take long for the ships to get there. And I don't have to keep scrolling up and down. Building under construction. 
Hmm. There isn't really... I mean, this place is going to be great. As soon as I get all these flat gun defenses offline... It doesn't look like they have a heavy factory either, though. So that sucks. This is a great place, though. We just have Count Dooku right here, and we actually found the good planet for it. So, we don't really need ground forces right now. What we need is ships. I don't want to waste any money on ground forces. Enemy fleet approaching. And they're approaching Fresha already. It's like as if they can... S can you even get... Oh, you can straight shot to Coruscant. Interesting. So, we need to take Coruscant if we're going to stop all the attacks. Oh, wait, no. They can still attack it at Annexes and Nexus and Atten, too. Hmm. This this is just always going to be under fire. I mean, Beginning I don't see how it wouldn't be. So it's just a good idea to just put hyper-velocity guns on all these planets. I just wish that I had another discount unit. Does Asajj Ventress give us discounts? She might. This is cheap. This is cheap. I don't know. Somebody's giving us discounts over here, and I don't know who it is. And Grievous doesn't give discounts either. So it's got to be a Saj Ventress, right? If I take a Saj Ventress and move her to Forrest... No. That didn't help at all. What are they assaulting? Trandosha! Of course they're assaulting Trandosha. Hey, look! No Wookiees! What a surprise, considering it's so close to Kashyyyk. Well, this should be an easy battle. Easy, because we have Trandoshans. It's interesting, I wish I could I wish I could build Trandoshans like they build Wookiees, and I wish they were just as overpowered. But you can't. But you can't. I think I'm just gonna hard code a, uh, a limit on Wookiees. Just to make this, you know, let's play a little bit more fun. It's really not fun fighting off Wookiees this way. Okay, uh, we're moving forward with our Trandoshan army. And then also our destroyer droids, who are basically going to take out these walkers single-handedly, probably. So let's just manually guide them in. Oh! Oh, man! They're really killing my destroyer droids. Come on! We have that ATAP out there blowing our crap up. We need, like, pressure on both at the same time. Kind of like this. Keep these destroyers on on point. And one's down. The other's down. Okay, we're good. This is weird also. I also would like to fix this. Because they bring down the heaviest armor on maps. And they can't port anything in. So it's like, shouldn't they bring down clone troopers first? That's such an easy fix, too. Oh, there's their Star Destroyer. I still have no idea how they're building this, but... You know, sure. Ooh, we can build a hyper-velocity gun on Corellia. I say we invest, and invest now. Hopefully, we can't build one on Rendili, can't we? I'd have to get rid of something. And I don't want to get rid of a mining facility, and I don't want to get rid of... I guess... Yeah, we could totally build it. Okay, so we'll we'll sell the droid works, and we'll build a hyper velocity gun on Randili as well. We'll build one up here too. We'll just build them everywhere. We're just literally just gonna hyper velocity every single planet. And they brought in a dreadnought. I managed to build a space station, and I have a munificent. So that means that I'm probably gonna win this battle, which is good. Keeping it low key. Only level one space stations all across the galaxy. If I could totally win that way, I would. Yes, sir. All right, upgrades, because we know we're gonna fight here yes. sooner or later. The Jedi have discovered our operation. Let's use our tri droids as a scout for to find those arc squadron, because I know they're gonna come at us, and they're the biggest threat actually. Dreadnought isn't, but the arcs totally are. So we're gonna try and find them. They're gonna come in really quick. There they are. There they are. Bus droids. Take them down. Turn on the point defense. They're already blowing up my hangar. 
but it's a good thing that this Dreadnought is already getting destroyed. Engines are already gone. No retreat for them. Arc 170 squadrons. Oh, come on, Tri-Droids. You know better than just sit around. We got work to do. There's arcs flying around. We gotta kill them. That sound of the engines is ridiculous. Keep upgrading. Get as much upgrades as we can in here. I love how the Dreadnought just flew away. Let's chase it with the Munificent. There's some arcs right there. Take them out. Tri-Droids are so good against arcs. Look at that. So good to have a Tri-Droid fleet. I wish Tri-Droids spawned out of space stations. That would make the defense a little bit better for the Confederacy. Alright, come on. One more arc squadron right there, and we're blowing up this dreadnought. It's totally on fire, trying to get away, but it's not going to, because we got a Munificent trailing it. And its fighter squadron is down. We've got all these bombers, and we're not using them either. Look at, the, look at all that you get <laughs> out of a level 1 defense. You don't get anything. Just cancel the upgrades. We don't want to waste any money. They won't get built by the time they retreat. Alright, that's good. We have a little bit of a defense there. This is literally like playing a... What are, what are those genres of games called? The uh, tower defense games. This is literally tower defense forces of corruption style. Because <laughs> it's literally all I can do. That's all I can do right now. So... We're just going to keep doing what I know how to do, and that's build providences and other confederacy paraphernalia. Like droids here. I don't know why we're wasting money out here when we have a production facility now so close to the front lines with discounts. Lots of discounts. It'd be a good idea to send Count Dooku while this is building and full. Send him up to Rendili once we get a new paycheck and get a discount on a hypervelocity gun right there. And does Asajj Vent... She doesn't do anything. So we'll just keep her back here, I guess. She'll be our commander for the outer... For the... West... Part of the galaxy. Constructing. Let's keep building factories. We want we want at least if the space defenses fall, we want the ground defenses to at least um, hold the line. Vehicle in production. So we gotta we gotta bunker up just a little Beginning bit. Construction. Build two heavy factories. Build another Beginning space station. Build Beginning another space station here. Spend all our money on space stations. Complete. And hope that it works. Got another space station up. And they are attacking me at Felucia Space. Level 1 Space Station. I'm just going to not waste my time. Thank you very much. We have um, flat guns on Felucia. And we also have apparently a Grand Arena. We need another flat gun over here. We also have an outpost. To build that outpost, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. Raxus Prime also does not have flat guns. See, we need flat guns on all these planets. All of them. All of them. All the planets with all the flat guns. What is this? No, I don't need, I don't need a research center. Imminent. Speak of the devil. Oh man, they brought a juggernaut in. Wow, that's the first time I see LATs and juggernauts in a, in actually assaulting a, my planet. They're probably just gonna put all their clones down first, but you know, whatever. I've seen it all, folks. I've seen it all already. Okay. Droids still floating. <laughs> Open fire. I love how every planet has like a quirk to it. Like, it's just so action. ridiculous. Alright, so I think I gotta send these guys Blast separately. And everybody else should move ish. Nope, they're not moving. Don't fail me, General. Okay. Now everybody's moving. Except these droids. Oh, ATAPs! ATAPs first, boys! Take that out, come on! 
We'll lose some destroyer droids, but it's worth in the long run because it won't we won't have artillery shelling down on our face. Just like that, and then turn around and just kill all this. Look at this. Imagine being swarmed by shielded destroyer droids like that. That's just evil. <laughs> they couldn't even land. The ship didn't even come down on the ground all the way. This is just going to be so tedious. I don't even think I want to show these off. Cool. We'll just drain their forces little by little. And maybe eventually we might win. Maybe. Enemy ships are massing for a possible strike. Okay, hopefully it's not here. Because we do not have anything ready for anybody. And we don't have enough credits for a level 4 space... Or level 3 or level 4? Level 4 space station. This is tense. Oh, we got a ship. We got a ship. Send it up. Send it. Raxus Prime. There it is again. No clones. Just lots of ATTEs and... LAATs. We don't have any flat guns. See, I don't know. Should I waste an entire credit week worth of credits on flat guns? I don't even know. It's just... It's just weird. I. It's like I want more space forces, but at the same time I want to keep all these planets alive. And flat guns are vital in that aspect. Just vital. Although it didn't help me on Kashyyyk, to be fair. Oh, why is the artillery so far ahead? Yes, sir. Oh, no. Oh, no. Alright, well, let's at least upgrade shields. Do we have any destroyer droids on the field? If not, then let's not waste our money. Alright, everybody. I wish I was one of the new G series. Come here. You guys go there. You guys just wait there, and hopefully they don't attack you here. Back off the explosives. We don't want to get that blowing all of us up. We almost blew up our own droid factory. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my goodness. Just don't fire at things, please. Artillery deploy. Yeah, we're moving out here. That's good. We have destroyer droids. Oh, we do have destroyer droids. Okay. Probably Worth the upgrade. So, we're just going to wait and see what they bring in. Yes, sir. Clones incoming at point two four. Oh, just clones. Just clones. That's good. Oh, perfect. See, that's, what, that's why we moved away from the barrels. Right there. So, we're good. We've got crab droids here on this flank. Move that up. And we're waiting for the rest of this army to move all the way up. I've never seen a jet. All right, don't I fire things. Just just move forward, please. Please. Okay. For the love of all that is holy. All right, here we go. Clones, light them up. Yes, sir. Ooh, ooh, we have a commando. Let's move him in. Let's do that. Sounds great. What's what's shelling us? Oh, the ATAPs. Okay, okay, okay. Destroyer droids, do your stuff. The rest of the army, move in on those guys. Plant some mines, please. So far, looking good. Destroy droids, what are you doing? Go over there. Kill it. Don't get crushed, though. Okay. Alright. Good, 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 good. So they brought down the worst possible units for that assault. If they brought in, like, a full army of ATTs, I would have been scared. But they didn't. Uh, we should spend something on something here. Another set of destroyer droids, please. Alright, so we're going to use this sweep of credits since we've... Oh, we have... We'll put up one space station... We're already getting attacked at Felucia by 16 Wookiees, 31 Clone Troopers, and 10 ATTs. And it looks like we have one, two, two flat guns? Not worth. Not worth. We'll move that up. We'll move this up. We're just going to rush the landing zone and hopefully it works. Because we, we're not going to survive on a... 
on a defense, a prolonged defense. Not against that many Wookiees and not against that many ATTs. They're just going to swamp us. So hopefully we can take Felucia. Not take it, but at least keep it. Keep it on our side. Okay, what do we got? This, I like this. This this might be proved to be good. Because if they're going to try, we're going to get tanks out of here. We're, we have a flat gun here. Shield generator in the middle. We've got droids coming out. I wish there was a flat gun right there, but there isn't. So, control all. Control right click. Attack. Go. I know you See what happens. Me. Ooh, let's put up a thing. Let's put up a thing. And I love how that environment just damages you. There's the Wookiees. There's ATT. Oh, we got destroyers. Or these guys, I mean. Move them around the back. Take out the landing zone. While the rest of the forces move up and basically commit suicide. Move these commando droids in the back here. Put down more mines. Hopefully some sabotage there. Just keep on. Oh, we almost killed the ATT. Just keep holding out. These crab droids are great damage soakers. I never realized that. Alright, we took out their landing zone, so this is all that they can possibly... There we go, there we go. This is all that we can that they possibly can have at the moment. So we're just gonna take them out. Clones dying, one ATT left. Come on, let's blow it up. Build a build pad, distract them. Destroyer droids are in. ATT down! Alright, Felucia's still here. Wow, this is the episode of land invasion defenses, it seems like. We lost two crab droids, but they were invaluable in that fight. Like, we soaked up so much damage. So that's great. Alright, we got our next 20,000 worth of credits. 4,000 goes in on the first space station. Oh, we can build that hypervelocity gun. I don't know what's more worth. The hypervelocity gun... Or flat guns everywhere. Flat guns everyone everywhere does sound great. At least on Raxus. They keep attacking us on Raxus, so it's going to go there. Haven't seen them attack Mintween yet. We completely actually forgot about this entire thing. We have a hyper-velocity gun on this planet. So it might be worth to... Building under construction. Because this is where we get the malevolence from. And it might be super worth to bunker up that planet. So we're going to do that. We haven't been attacked on any of these other ones. We've been attacked on Kessel once, but... Two, I mean, like, it's not worth. It's really... It is 320 credits, but it isn't really that worth. What's another planet that could possibly get attacked? This one I haven't seen attacked yet. And we don't want to waste money on dark side adepts because I assume that they suck. They have a land invasion force above here. I wish I could hit this with something, but I have no fleet here. So, the rest of the money should go in a... Sh oh, shipbuilding production. Speaking of which, that's about to be done. So, ship... Gotta get a ship online. Gotta get another ship online down here. And there's all our week's credits. And that's it, folks. And now we just wait for another week of credits. And hopefully we can... Last... All right, we have another Lucre Hulk. Let's send it. Tactical battles. Oh in. man. Okay, we're not sending it anywhere because they're attacking us at Trandosha again for the umpteenth time. It sounds like I'm going to be cutting out a lot of this. We'll see. We'll see what happens. They're right on top of us. Yeah, right on top of us, says the guy. There's only four walkers. Calm down. You can easily take this. Is there explosive barrels here too? What is that? Von Skurden? Okay, let's upgrade the shields on our destroyer droids, shall we? 
Oh, they're actually moving their ATPTs. That's interesting. I've never seen him actually move them. They're just getting absolutely shredded. ATPTs suck. I want to use this model, though, for Awakening of the Rebellion. Because this is such a better, better model. It also has a death animation. I need to find out who has this model and where it is. Because I want it. I want it in my life. I'm going to make it a lot better of a unit. But the, I'm going to make it a lot smaller, too. Because this... Because, like, the scale is a lot different in this mod versus ours. But we definitely want that. We want that model. Okay. Space Station coming online. The defensive game. Sorry if it's... I guess complete. the defense is boring, you guys, but this is the way to win. There's no complete. other way to win except this way. So I'm just doing what I know. What do we build here? A, sp a final space date. Okay, cool. So we have another 24,000. Construction complete. Online. We're waiting for another 24,000 to come in. You know what? I, I complain a lot about not having a good defense. But to be honest, we have more planets than them. We're making a lot of credits. We can definitely win this. Oh, there's the Kessel invasion I was talking about. This is actually going to be tough. This is actually going to be tough because we only have two buildings on this planet and they have a lot of Wookiees, clones, and ATTs. It sounds like at least they started building clones once I took Kashyyyk over. So, I put some money into clones. Don't fail me, General. Oh, AT... ATAB. Does that mean that this is the only unit that they have on the ground? Alright, those guys on that guy, those guys on that guy. Keep both under pressure. Those are the only units they launched. Yes, awesome. Okay, uh, never mind what I said. We're all good. We're all good. As long as they keep bringing down AT APs at the start of the battle, we are all okay. We are okay. Oh, we built some hammer pickets. Set up some hammer pickets up here. I wonder if it's worth to build those hammer pickets. Mechus 3. Entire invasion at Mechus 3. We do not have a hyper velocity. Uh, is it is it worth to even pour in money to space stations if we don't have a hyper velocity cannon on these worlds? I don't even know. Tactical we're gonna get we're engine. not even gonna get a level three. So Building get our canceled. credits back for that. And just auto resolve because it's not worth it. They're gonna assault us at Mechus, whether we like it or not. We do have two heavy factories now. Complete. And flat guns. Android works and other stuff. So we should be okay on that planet. Hopefully. Hopefully. But they did just launch an invasion, so they're probably going to finish it off with a ground invasion real quick. We have built... Oh, we have enough money for a hyper velocity. So, Count Dooku, please, give us a discount. We need the discount. We need every discount we can, can get as I get invaded by a juggernaut lats. Oh, look, no Wookiees. I'm surprised. I am so surprised about this. But yeah, honestly, after this episode, I have, I have officially decided I'm going to go into the files and I'm going to limit the amount of Wookiees you can build. I'm not going to make them weaker or anything like that. I don't want to mess with the, the balance, even though they are totally overpowered. I'm going to limit them to like 10 squads, and that's all they can get is 10 squads. Holy crap, look at all these flak guns. What in the world... When I signed up for the 4,000 credits worth of flat guns, I did not expect 20-something flat guns. <laughs> wow. And we get these guys out of it. MTTs? Are these MTTs? No. They're AATs. And HMPs gain a 10% movement increase. We don't need that upgrade because why? We probably have some destroyer droids somewhere, or maybe we don't. I don't even see any, like, ground forces. All I have is flat guns and, like, my reserves. So, hopefully we can, uh, 
get everybody down to... Let's get everybody down here, at least, first. And stuff is spawning, so I'm just massing control A. Don't fail me, General. Alright, we're moving that way. We have these awesome crab, or... What are these guys called? Droid tanks? So we've got those. I don't think we have any destroyer droids, but... Ah, whatever. This is the slowest army I've ever seen moving. They are totally going to end up at our flat guns with clones or something and blow us out of the water. Here they come. Nice miss. Nice miss again. Please, get something up there. Please, we need something quick. Please, anything. They're going to blow up our first flat gun defense. Before we can even get there. We got a second one right here. I'm gonna hold off on shooting it until the ATT comes into range. There we go. Easy kills. Or not. Alright, now it's an easy kill. Alright, let's send these guys into enemy lines. Sneak them in. Take out the landing zone. No! No, not, don't, no, no. Fire at this. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. This range is atrocious. Send in another set of commando droids in case those die off. Alright, fire at the LAT. Or a ATTD, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Uh, mines first. Then go to the landing zone. Why are you guys not on the landing zone? I will never know. Take that over. Our, uh... Our stuff's doing pretty well here. We're doing good against this first ATT. We've taken that out. Let's move everybody back. Out of here. Build those turrets. Get the rest of the troops up on this ATT. All right, back up. Never mind. Change my mind. Wait for something more to come in. Oh, this is taking forever. These droids, they're just walking through lava, taking their time. This is all we have. We're going to have to do some crazy, sneaky commando droid stuff. Are these guys cloaked? They're not cloaked yet. Let's wait for that. Wow, why is this guy... Oh, this guy repairs. That's right, I remember. I uh, I discovered that it repairs, like, everything. Tanks and stuff a couple episodes ago. So, hopefully... Those ATTs don't come in too quick. We don't have any more flat guns. And we, these guys... Stealth fields need to come online so I can mine the last ATT on the planet. And we gotta watch out because we don't want to wait long enough that the bombing run, they can bombing run me. But I do have so many flax on this planet. We should be okay. There it is, just sitting there. Probably deciding what to do with life. Alright, we've thrown mines at it. Let's see what happens, how much damage we do. Not bad. Not bad. Let's send in this force on this ATT. I think we are, we should be okay with this. Yep, and this repair droid is... I'm just going to micro-repair droids in battles. That's what I'm going to do. Make sure they... Like, he's repairing the right units that are getting shot at. And they don't die. That's the way to win... Um, land invasions. With the CIS. Is just... Make sure that you're... Uh, Oh, there's another one. Oh, see, just like that, we lost our repair guy, but we won the match. So, we're good. Mechas 3 defended. That was good. Oh my gosh, another assault. It's never ending, guys. It's never ending. Okay. Let's try to move in. Oh, that's what I do. Okay, cool. So if I cancel their movement, everybody else moves fine. Cool. I know you will not fail me. How do I fix this? 
Okay, there's our entire <laughs> destroyer droids for defense, guys. Can't recommend it nearly enough. Just look at this. It's 48 destroyer droids right on the landing zone. Already blown everything. Oh my goodness. Get out of there before you die. They've launched an ATT. Watch how quickly I take this out. It's trying to. <laughs> Holy crap. Destroyer droids can't recommend them enough. Look at this. Surefire way to win. This pile. I like how the clone's still sitting up there, like, chilling on top of the turret. He doesn't die or anything. He's just like, yeah. Hey, guys. My ATT's destroyed. <laughs> How's it going? All right, sweet. Beginning Hype for Velocity Gun. I'm already giving like acronyms to stuff. Hyper Velocity Gun on that planet. We probably would want one up here, but not sure for Very good. So we're not gonna do it yet. And plus we have another ship to be built. Gotta keep on that ship production. Unit. Bulk cruiser this time. Let's mix it up a little bit. What do we got here? We I think we have enough there. I think we need to reinforce that area more than any other area. Felucia planetary battle again. Oh boy. Everybody move on the landing zone. Don't fail me, General. Oh, how many times have I failed you count through two? Like zero times. Unit destroyed. Unit destroyed? What? what? Rancors? Oh. Interesting. Oh, there's our amazing, ridiculous Wookiee Warrior squads of death. Man, are Rancors really like, they're crapping on me. They're crapping on me. It's ridiculous. Wow. ATAP versus... Uh, versus AATs, not good. They're pushing in with a lot of clones. Mostly Wookiees, though. That's the problem here. They might... It's not looking good. It's not looking good at all. Why are you guys standing in death? Get out of death. Oh, boy. Alright, whoa, 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 don't kill him. They killed them all. And there's nothing we can do against a Wookiee onslaught like this. Literally zero. We might as well go into, like, holdout mode. And hopefully this force up here can flank up and get them from up top at that landing zone. They're gonna go to this landing zone, though. They're gonna take it. This planet is lost. I don't see it surviving. They're already pushing in all the way down here. Blowing up my droid works. Alright, let's see if some B1s can at least take out some clones. Come on, please. Got another force up here. My one of two flat guns is offline now. Nothing gets past me. I forgot my orders. I'm just trying to reinforce all the units at the key locations. This should have been an anti-infantry turret. I'm not sure why I made an anti-vehicle turret, but oh well. There's our Wookiee warriors. We're killing them, which is good. Oh boy, clones in the middle of our lines. LAT just came down. Oh snap. Oh snap. There's nothing I can do here, folks. This is basically it. They're landing. Wow, they're, they actually know how to like stack units up. That's great. Look at all these lads now. Oh my goodness. All right, they're flanking us from here. 
Put up an anti-infantry turret. We need an anti-air turret, too. What were my orders? What was that again? But it's looking like this battle is a losing cause. I want to be upgraded to a G series. Which makes me very, very sad. Have you seen the new droid? I need service. Yep, there's the lat. Maybe I can get a thing up before they blow up. Power generator, because once they take out the power generator, that defensive area right there is lost as well. Charge them. I want to see some action. Let's see if we can't shoot them. I also would like this is the other LAT I'd like for um, awakening of the rebellion as well. Not that exact type, but I think the one from Thrones Revenge. What? The flat guns miss too? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Our base is under attack. I just realized that this game is not meant to be played against the Republic. It's just not. There goes the uh, flat gun defense. I'm just going to auto resolve it because we're done here. Felucia's lost. And that always sucks to lose a planet, doesn't it? It really sucks. We could have done something a little bit better there. We could have won something more. They're going to keep assaulting me, but I think I'm just going to try and hold out. And I think I'm going to end the episode here, guys, because I'm getting a little bit tired of defending planets. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I know it's all defense all the time, but it's looking like that's that's what's going to be the uh, that's what's going to be the flavor of the month these days, especially with this mod it being as unbalanced as it is. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to finish off these last AT APs, and I'll see you guys in the next part. See you later.